Hi guys, my name is Carly Hughes and this is my home. Good Housekeeping asked me to take you on a little tour of my cupboards and pantries and drawers so you could see how I organize. And I'm so excited because I have some surprises for you. So follow me. Okay, this is the first room. This is my bathroom and we are on the floor of my bathroom because this is one of my favorite drawers and I'm gonna show you why. I'm obsessed with skincare as you will find in the next you know, couple minutes, but this drawer, has all face masks, sheet face masks, and this is what it looks like. I, face masks normally come in like packs of five in these thick boxes, so I take them out of the box so that it's not as bulky and I can stack them in there. These are by Nesco. I also got this little container. See, it's just a plastic container, but this container holds face masks, and I take this container, stuff it, put it in the drawer because they're sheet masks, they're all paper. So if you didn't have stability, they'd flop around. And then what I do is I take all the other ones, the fancy ones, and I stack them in and around the little plastic container that I have in there. So this drawer is packed, nothing's falling around and I can get to things easily. Now, one of my favorite face masks. This is the 3D Hydrogel face mask by Babor, Dr. Babor. It's amazing. It's like that biocellulose material. It hydrates really well and it feels so relaxing on. Another favorite of mine is the Glam Glow bubble sheet. You put it on, it's black. As soon as it activates, it turns bubbles all over your face and it's really fun, but it also hydrates. I'm really big on hydration. And then the next thing in the store, the last thing I promise, there's a new trend. It's sheet masks for your decolletage for your stomach and for your bum and you know a bottom. So this is what they look like. Um, I bought the ones by Yes2, which is another um, all natural skincare line, which is very good for you. This is what the bum looks like. They have these little hearts, but you like do a face mask before your bum. Okay, the next part of my skincare collection is under the sink, okay? So everyone's under the sink has the pipes and everything, but I found cute ways to organize despite those things. So one of my first things is another bin. I'm really big into bins. This is just, you can get these at Target, just a little carrier, but this holds all of my under eye masks that I use every morning, especially the days I work and I'm called at like 5 a.m. The next thing that I really love are these double layer containers. Let me see if you can. Oh yeah, there you go. They're double layered and they each stack on top of each other and then they pull out for more storage. And it also has these amazing ampules, which a lot of people may not be familiar with, but they look like this and you, they're glass. You crack them open and they are full of these lovely serums and ceramides and peptides for your skin that you can put on alone or at night or under your regular moisturizer and I love them. These are also by Dr. Babor and I have tons of them. They're just amazing. Beauty Rescue, Vitamin C Serum, they're all these amazing serums that just keep your skin glowing. Okay, we're almost done, I promise. There's just one little thing that I want to show you and it's up there. Okay, let's go. Okay, so now we are at sink level. This is where I keep everything that I tend to use once or twice a day and every day. I got this little two-tiered compartment and, and product holder from Target. I got also those shelves underneath from Target. So what I keep up here are my Kate Somerville and my Tatcha supplies because they're two of my favorite lines and they work really great for my skin and so I keep them within arm's reach. This is, um, Kate Somerville has a lot of different lines, Exfolicate, and this is the new Delicate. She puts her name in everything, which I love. This is the Delicate. They have a cleanser, and they have a moisturizer and a um, serum, which I'll show you, but this moisturizer, I love it. it. It feels thicker than it is, and then you take it out and you put it on, and it goes on sheer, yet it moisturizes a lot. I'm really big on moisturizing if you can't tell. So I love this um, this line. They also have a new serum that's called Delicate Recovery Serum. It's awesome, it's full of omegas. What it does is you put it on under your moisturizer or by itself. I like to do it during the day and it provides an extra layer, mm -hmm, see that? An extra layer of protection for your skin with the nutrients and stuff that are in it. And again, it goes on sheer. I don't like things that are too heavy because it does, they don't work well with my skin. 
The other products I keep up here is the Tatcha line. Love the Tatcha line. So Tatcha has this dewy skin cream, which is one of their moisturizers. Their colors are amazing, it smells amazing. And again, it goes on, it goes on not heavy, which is good for me. They also have two of my other favorite things and then and then I'll, I'll take you to another room, I promise, but I'm obsessed. This is their Silk Peony Eye Cream, and this is the new, this is their new face mask, which we know I love. Violet C Radiance Mask. It's this color, hence Violet C, but it's so moisturizing, and it's for like all skin types, it says, and it's called Violet C because it has vitamin C in it, duh. I did this one for the first time, like, I don't know, a while ago, and my skin was so happy after I put it on. I don't know. All of the Tatcha stuff also comes with applicators, which I appreciate, especially in the age of Corona when you don't want to put your hands in everything. It's really smart. Now I'm going to take you to my most favorite room of organization. I don't even think you're ready, but follow me. Okay, we are now in my guest room, and this is my guest room closet. So, sorry, not sorry, to all of my guests that come and can't use the closet because... Are you ready? Let me turn the light on for you. This, I mean, is what I have turned into my shoe closet. This, I had professionally installed because, you know, they're my babies. These are racks from the container store. There's six on each side and they each slide out and they each hold nine pairs of heels because I only wear heels. I think I have maybe three pairs of flats. So this is my closet. This is my, I call it my shoe shrine. I come in here, I can easily see which shoe I want. If I can't, I just pull the, the rack out. I'm, I'm really obsessed with this whole setup in here and you can go to, here, let me show you. You can go to the container store and they have it all there for you. So my obsession with Christian Louboutin shoes, I, I can't even apologize for it. They're works of art and I personally, um, I think the shoe makes the outfit. You can throw on jeans and a t-shirt and throw on one of these fabulous heels and be elevated to a whole new level. At least feel that way, you know. I love I really love what what shoes do to to you. So this is why I turned my guest room closet into a shoe shrine. I mean, look at these. Can we talk about it? Can we talk about it? Look at that. Oh, you guys. I mean, what was I supposed to do? Also, they're flats. Because I told you I don't wear flats. I have, you know, a couple pair. These are Louis Vuitton as well. Uh -huh. But look how cute. And this is my this is my other pair of flats. They're Louis Vuittons as well, but look. Go. Listen, they're an investment. I still style myself. And so I am able to come in here when I have um, red carpet events and easily pick out what shoe I need and what's gonna match the outfit that I have for that event and that evening. So, sorry, not sorry. Go to the container store and get these shoe racks. They also make them for flats where they're not these rungs, they're like little beds, but I clearly didn't need racks for flats. Oh, okay, one more little cupboard pantry and then and then y'all got to get out my house. All right, let's go. Okay, so now we are in my kitchen and I have this cool little inset pantry room, but my washer and dryer used to be side by side, which meant I didn't have any room for a pantry. So I stacked them and then what I did was I bought this cool, amazing pantry unit from Target.com for like 140 bucks. It fit in the space perfectly, it had different colors, so I bought the one that matched mine, and I turned this into a pantry for my snacks, because I love snacks. I, I really like snacks. But the amazing part about this, which keeps my spirit happy, is that I got these cool, clear containers. They look like this. You can normally find them at Home Goods and Marshalls, but Bed Bath & Beyond has them and they're clear, they hold everything. This is my little cracker section, and whenever I want something, I pull it out, get my snack, and then I can store it back in here. This is my other favorite one, because this is where I store my chips. 
I'm such a snacker, but I like to try to find healthy options, right? These wild chicken chips, it sounds insane, but they dip like a chip, they crunch like a chip, but they're really chicken. They come in barbecue and sea salt and salt and vinegar, but anyway, this is where I keep my snacks, in this clear container. They come in various sizes. I got, let's say two, four, six of all the same size for these shelves so that I can hold all my snackies. And then underneath this shelf right here is where I keep all my vitamins and my collagen boost and my protein powders because I do smoothies. So then I got this is another um, size, if you will, of the clear. I kept them all uniform, they're all clear. You can also find these at Bed Bath & Beyond. And I put my collagen tabs and my electrolyte tabs and everything that I need to be easily accessible in one of these so that I constantly know. And then on this shelf I have my protein powder, but all the vitamins, protein powders are there. All of my snacks are here, all of my chips are here, and all of my crackers are here, and all I have to do is go, oh, what do I want? And then put it back. I really love these um, containers. They make my heart happy, and they make my little OCD side do a little shimmy. Um, yeah, that's it. So this is my snack pantry with all of my chibi chips and my vitamins. And you know what, guys? That's all I got for you. Thank you so much for visiting me in my home. Subscribe to Good Housekeeping. And if you wanna watch me cook and do a little cooking with Carly segment, follow me on Instagram, at Carly Hughes. I think you guys are awesome. Thank you for watching. Mwah.